Hello and hi, welcome to Yedidishovid.net and welcome to this week's Halacha of the Week, week number 28. And today's question, which was addressed to the Chief Rabbi, or Mordechai Liao, Alava Shalom, is Rabbi, I pray in a Bet Knesset. This Bet Knesset, this synagogue, is up in uh, the north of Israel. And uh, what we do is we light our Shabbat candles at the Bet Knesset. We light it at the synagogue. Question is, there was a rabbi who came in and said, you guys shouldn't continue doing this. Did the rabbi have any validity towards what he was saying, or is he correct? And uh, as well as uh, Kiddush, in the Bet Knesset as well, the Kiddush in the synagogue as well, is that an issue? Because now we're wondering about what this rabbi was telling us. So, the chief rabbi answers, he says that, the Shulchan Aruch, the court of the Jewish law, it goes through many of these uh, little discussions about what you do in a Bet Knesset, what you do in a synagogue, what you don't do. And he says, first and foremost, that by lighting the candles of Shabbat, you definitely don't say a bracha in a synagogue, and better that you don't even light Shabbat candles in a synagogue. So many people are going to say that, hey, but it's Shabbat, you should have a symbol for Shabbat. So the rabbi says this, he says, the only light that you light in a synagogue is the light of Chanukah. Because Chanukah is a light that gives a feeling of Pirsum Enisa, commercializing the miracle, making it known. Now people who come to synagogue and they already see the candles are there, they already feel that their obligation for the Nerot of Shabbat, for the candles of Shabbat, has already been taken care of. So because of that, the Rabbi says, I know each and every individual, they have to have a chance to light the candles at their house. It's not like in synagogue where you do many of the things in synagogue so you don't have to do it at home in case you didn't get around to do it. This is one of the things that you have to do at your house 100%. It's not like Havdalah, which after Shabbat they do in Kenisa, they do in Bet Knesset, and then you're okay. But rather, it's its own mitzvah that you have to take care of at your house before you come to synagogue because it's not like a Chanukiah it's not like a menorah it's not like a, uh, a, a display item just to make people more uh, known about this holiday but rather it's a mitzvah of its own that you should partake in and that you have to take care of and not just have it left for a Bet Knesset I want to wish you a beautiful day, and I'll see you tomorrow for Jewish Wisdom, week number 28.